Are you on? Okay. All right, so here she's had her bath. We like to use the radiant warmer after our little sponge baths just to make sure that they maintain their body temperature. Um, and we're happy to go over all the bath demo with you here in the nursery. Just noting some normal characteristics on babies. Um, here's a little bit of that normal newborn rash. 80 to 90% of babies have this rash. It's just a little fluctuation of their hormones from being born or maybe a little you know, sensitivity from this new environment. So this is their crib, the radiant warmer here in the nursery. And I was gonna show you too the importance of knowing how to use your bulb suction. So we provide this to you in your crib. It's great to take home. Make sure you keep it in your diaper bag when you're in the car, the baby's in the car seat. It's very common that babies will be spitty in that first couple of days to even weeks. So making sure you know how to use this. Babies will bring up formula or breast milk or some mucus but they don't know how to clear that from their mouth. So think of the alphabet M before N. You always wanna clear their mouth first and then their nose. So I like to teach parents to squeeze it away from them because you never wanna squirt air into their mouth or nose. And when we get anxious and we see a baby that might be choking, we, we do things rushed. So get in the habit of squeezing the air out away from you and then clear her mouth first. So you can roll them to their side or you can sit them up as if you're burping them. Um, you might hear her burp or see her choke you a little bit. So squeeze it, just use it in the sides of her cheeks. You're not gonna go straight in her mouth. And then you just let go. And if she were to be spitty, that would get any secretions out of her mouth. So just sides of her cheeks and then squirt it out. And then you can use the nose, do the nose if you need to. Just rinse this with hot soapy water if you're using it frequently to rinse it out. And then if you are using it quite often, have another one on hand and throw this one out. 